Hello my cyber babies. Welcome to the Mother Love YouTube channel. This handsome fella sitting here with me is David McAbee. He is a writer, director, producer, and it's a good thing he's good looking because something wrong with him. I think the man touched in the head. But he's written this movie for, right in time for Halloween called Night Terrors. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the YouTube channel. Thank you Mother Love. It's good to be here. It's wonderful to have you. So now, here you are. You come from Cayucas. Did yeah, I pronounce it right? Got it. Yeah, no, right out of the Don't that sound like a venereal disease, y'all? I'm like, and the itchy one. See, itchy. you see, something is wrong with y'all. We need this one little window for David, <laughs> and you just, just go right on. Sneak right on in there. Just dip in. Hey, uh -huh. Dip in the window. <laughs> now, have, have you always been this creative, even growing up as a boy? Yeah, I mean, I grew up uh, playing in bands with friends, and then I was a touring musician for a long time, and then I was what a do radio. You play? Uh, I was I was a bass player for a long time, uh -huh. um, and then was a radio DJ. And then moved out here and started writing. And, and from Cayucas. Yes, from Cayucas. It's yeah. a little time that we don't really want to tell you where it is because it's beautiful. I don't want to give away the it secret. It still sounds like something on your foot, like the caucus. Remember when Duke, oh, that sounds like something oh, on the bottom of your shoe. Yeah, uh, your you shoe. You stepped yeah. in some Duke caucus. <laughs> Ew, well, my. It smells like Duke caucus in here. <laughs> so, it's a, like I said, it's a good thing you're good looking because you got to be kind of nutty to work in this business and especially to work behind the camera to mm -hmm. wear so many hats with so mm -hmm. many people how do you keep your sanity okay now forget that part yeah, sanity, you know, that okay. escapes. i lost my yeah, i you, lost my yeah. spot and we yeah. don't we're not saying mm -hmm. <laughs> that escaped years ago but i love i love the stress mm -hmm. of being behind the camera and putting out a ton of different fires and making things happen I mean, that's fun. Now, do you have, uh, what kind of a director are you? Because, you know, I, I, I'm a bona fide movie star. Yes, I did. Oh, I have no. made 13 movies. Look it up on my IMDb PXQ of Y page, whatever that is. Close enough, yeah. Uh, close enough. Yeah. And, you know, d d different directors have different mm -hmm. styles, and I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. You know, you got your screaming directors, you have your creative directors, you have directors that just sit there and say, okay, go do your thing. Okay. Uh, I like what to kind yell. of director are I'm, you? I'm, I'm a big yeller. I could see. Yeah, yeah I'm not I am not no, buying that. No, <laughs> no I, 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 I like to collaborate. Mm -hmm. I like, I'd like everyone to be on the same page. And if you, as the actress, want to try something, maybe let's try it. Okay. But you know, maybe we try it my way. But we also can try. Like as long as we're on the same path to making something mm -hmm. cool, I like to collaborate. I like to put our minds together. Sometimes other ideas are better than the others, and that's the way it works. And that's what that's what's beautiful about directors like you, because you don't come in, and you and you got to be you know like I got to put the hammer down, and let me be the one to put the hammer down, mm -hmm. and. But then when you're when you when you feel confident enough in yourself mm -hmm. as a director to say, okay. Well, let's try that. See, I'm, I'm for that. I don't care where the idea comes from. As long as, as long it's as a good, good idea. idea. Yeah. I could get it from a kid. I could get it from a senior citizen. Wherever it is. Mm -hmm. What inspires you as a filmmaker? Life. I mean, life, life is always happening. and Things are changing all the time. And those are the things I like writing about. Sure, this is a horror movie, but there's a lot of real life things going on that people for real deal with. Not just the pop out monsters, the real life monsters. Okay, like what is, when you talk about storyline, mm -hmm. because to me most horror story, most horror movies don't have a storyline. Mm -hmm. What's the storyline? What's the meat of the film? At the end of the day, it's about chasing your dreams and not getting what you hoped you would get and life taking a different turn. Or may, or, or, our main actress, uh, Lorraine Landon, plays Jane and she's a Washed up movie star, her career was did not go the way she had planned, and she's bitter and she's drunk and she's gonna take it out on her daughter. Oh my goodness! That no, okay, that's a story. That right there, and we've seen that happen so many mm -hmm. times. Realistically, I mean, we've lost so many artists who really can't seem to cope with the with the with the with the weight of mm -hmm. being in this business because you think it's gonna last forever. Absolutely. I know I thought it was gonna last forever and I tell people this all the time. It take care of your body. Take care of your body and your mind and your spirit because all three of them suckers will double cross you <laughs> and you will find out you'll be living longer. Uh oh wait a minute. Oh, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. oh Lord life happened. Now I gotta be a grown up. Yeah. Boo. Yeah that boo his boo, boo his mm -hmm. what tell us about the little boy in you? I think you're looking at him. <laughs> he just yeah, grew a he beard. Just, he just grew a he beard. Just... He just got lazy and didn't want to shave anymore. 
<laughs> You're looking he at said, I'm, I'm still a kid, still you know. A kid. <laughs> now, are we, we're going to take a break and we're okay. going to come back. This is David Maccabee. He's written Night Terrors, and we'll be back.